So now that I determined this voltage coming in, which is supposed to go on the core side, which is right here. We have another one going here. What's supposed to happen? What's supposed to happen? All right, guys. So I just determined this voltage here coming in. This is where it comes in on the low voltage side, which you guys said, we, well, previously in the video, you guys saw it was 24 volts or 26 volts. Now it goes to the contactor. Now I check right here on the contactor side, make sure the power going to the contactor coil is 24. In this case, we have 26 volts. So that tells me we have voltage. So now that I determined this voltage coming in, which is supposed to go on the core side, which is right here. We have another one going here. What's supposed to happen? What's supposed to happen is this contact supposed to pull in just like that. So what did that tell me? I just determined we have, I'm sorry. I uh, call. <laughs> yes, we can put that to the side. I just determined that we have voltage on the high side. I just determined we have voltage on the low side and that contact that pull in. So I know this voltage at the contactor. So what did that determine right away? The contactor is bad. We need a new contactor. So guys, that's how you do troubleshoot. You always start from the beginning and you work yourself to the end.